So that was a taste of a little uh, side quest there. Now the main event for tonight is this is the part of the quest where we go visit Sebastian's sick sister. Okay? So I'm going to go back, turn on the main story quest, and then we're going to go meet up with Sebastian. You'll see that I've started wearing uh, gray vests on top of gray t-shirts. You know? Not everyone could pull off this look, but, uh, you know, I think I'm doing pretty good. Don't explode it real good. Is that everyone? Is that everyone? Come on, guys, please. Let's get this over with. Oh, I agree. Oh, he blocked my combo. spell in here just for this one guy. Sure. Did you use up all the power on my phone? No. Okay, let me see. Okay, you're started. You're started. Okay. They're like, what? Like, Please just leave now, for the love of Pete. Get the, get the heck out of Dodge. I mean, seriously. <sighs> okay. Alright, well, it's been fun, but... Whew. I, I gotta take that hat off. It's, it's just too warm. It's just too warm, guys. I do have central air, but it has its limits. Okay. Shadow of the estate. So we're going to meet Sebastian and Felk. I have no idea what a Felcroft is. Great, an invisible wall. So, okay, well, so I activated the quest told me to go towards the place and then I hit an invisible wall saying I can't go to the place so I don't know what to do. Now that I'm in Hogsmeade I now see an actual trail I can follow. I assume that okay so it's still 2600 steps in that direction where 
where, where the hell am I going? 2600 steps. Something, something's not right here. What the heck is this stuff? So it's an actual place on the map. It's not some cut scene or anything. It's nice to be able to see. Whoa, I am. I am off the path. Okay, so it's time to admit that uh, I might have taken a wrong turn. Okay, so now I'm in the same predicament. I can't go to a new place while I'm up. Let me just. What do you mean I can't dismount here? Screw you. So is it... All right, so look, I, I hate to be um, a negative Nancy. I'm typically a very positive gamer, you know, but is this kind of, you know, invisible wall stuff that really chafes my ass. I, I hope I don't get um, demonetized for saying that it, um, it chafes my ass. But it's just when so much time and money goes into these games, there's a little bit more effort. Okay? You all could have um, we all could have not had those invisible walls. literally all night collecting those stupid wounds and then some guy just sends me a letter and that's how I find out who did it. You look familiar. Hello. Do you have anything for sale? Hello. It's not often I see Hogwarts students here during the school year. I'm Priya Treadwell at your service and I sell a variety of traveling necessities. Wigan Weld. Wigan Weld. What do you have for sale? I need Wigan Weld. Let's have a look, shall we? Okay. You won't be disappointed. I can promise you that. Okay, thank you. So nice of you to stop by. Boom. Wait, this is all... Did she just pick all the stuff off the ground, turn around and try to sell it? I wish I could do that. It's like, here I am busting my ass trying to be a successful streamer or YouTuber or whatever. Why don't I just like go out in the woods and like pick up some rocks and acorns and then like stand there and on the side of the road and sell them to people? You know? I mean, for like, not, not an unreasonable amount, you know, $100 a piece, you know? I probably make more money doing that than I have done in uh, on YouTube because I haven't made any money on YouTube yet. 
I've been uploading since 2013. I've yet to make any money on YouTube. Dublin Challenge over to the left? What? I'm stealing the eggs of some horrible creature. Hope they don't find out and kill me. a nice waterfall. I really like that. Now I love to stop and fight these guys and you know so everyone here in my stream can see how horrible I am at combat. But you know oh, come on they're, they're everywhere. This is the correct Hamlet. Oh, wow. Even the friggin' lady from the flu thing. You made it. This is where we chuck bottles. Keeping an eye on things. Belcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Grand Rock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there, Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former aura and refuses to look into it, even after Anne was cursed by one, possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin of such a wizard kind as wand carriers. Are goblins forbidden from carrying wands? Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us, which is saying something, knowing me and Omen. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anne I used to know. Come on, I'll take you to my uncle's. This way. Felcroft used to be a lot livelier. Wait, did With you just... Lot wandering about all the time. Everyone stays out of sight. Here we are. My sister should be just inside. You fast-traveled here and made me walk alone. You jerk. Seems fine to me. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure. When will you accept that? Never. I can. <laughs> Gets really bad gas. That boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes, the Sebastian friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He he's in the wrong. Know when to stop. He thinks he can help Anne, oh, but nothing can be done for her. It could be that you've not yet discovered the cure. Nah, you sound like Sebastian, thinking you know better than the healers of St. Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. 
some sort of dark magic curse to Anne. And the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves anytime soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the loyalists' way. I'm gonna push him. He's a dick. We will do it best, sir. Hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. I hope you'll remember what I've said. Good day. Yeah, uh, kill all the hope in children. That's what's for the best. Right, gotcha. Oh, nice to see you, my young friend. Just, just you and me facing the wall. Just you and me. Oops, Sebastian went back up to the thingy. Oh, Sebastian. Gee, I sure do hope we don't have to go on some kind of quest to that castle in the distance that he pointed out. That would be a shame. Those hoes. Yeah. Ooh. Somebody's getting a tan. One of those fake things. Jeez. Finally, a lot. I'm going to say after completing this mini quest, um, Can't wait till end. Oh, come on, there's a demi guy's moving right here. Ugh. All right, I'll finish the quest uh, so I can advance the time. I'm sorry about earlier. Maybe you shouldn't right drink so much milk. I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. And I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts, and often suddenly. It's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by Except the for the people who cursed you. You must be the new fiftieth Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met during Did a you know I started Hogwarts in my fifth year? Oh, dear Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother, and me, in line. I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being in Felcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home. It's not the cozy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an Ithora, but refusing to go after Van Rock's loyalists. I must say... I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated. Wince. Like what happened to me, and why Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both 
doing him well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. I was worried that you might have some hope left in your soul, but I'm happy to know that it's all been abandoned. You know what? I deserve an apple for all that soul crushing I just did. I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. Yeah, screw him. I'll admit I wasn't expecting him to be so angry. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow. Always calling me my father's son. As if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. Oh, we're going this way, okay. All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. Up there, on that plateau, is where they cursed and... Jump, Jan, jump! This way. <laughs> 